Hey guys, it's Waffle Flash. Welcome to our Sad Screen New Let's Play Part 11. Um, we are about to start sequence. Five. We're about to start sequence five. Yeah. Um, I want to show you something real quick. Wait. Oh, it's these. Um, these are companion missions. If you don't want to play Dead Kings, um, before you're done playing this, which I don't know why you wouldn't, but um, this is really the only way to get money. So I did like three of these. Uh, that's how I got money. This one I just did. And I got the rapier, which is um, it's it's not that good. it's not as good as the sword I have now. But yeah, so I show you guys that uh, how you start the best way to get money. Um, me and Dave are gonna do those later. And first Dead Kings. Yeah, this is Dead Kings. You can't see the sequences for that yet, because I haven't started playing it. I've already beaten it though. But just not in this save. So yeah, we're gonna start sequence four, memory two no, sequence five, memory one. We just did sequence four, memory two in the last episode. Once it's unloading. Something I can help you with? What is this place? It connects to the sanctuary. Less flashy than the Saint Chapelle entrance, but we own the building. Used to be part of our intelligence network. But the place has fallen on hard times. How can I help? I'll keep an ear out for any opportunities that come up. You might also speak to the Intendant about renovating the building itself. I'm not exactly flush with coin just now. Any revenues the cafe generates are yours to do with as you see fit. The money is deposited in the chest in the study. And the more improvements you make... The more revenue. Quite. You might also find that expanding our reach into other districts will pay dividends. Merci. That was a way better cutscene. So, like I um, showed you guys before, well, I didn't show you, but in the final cutscene of the last episode, my graphics quality was at low. Right now, everything is at high except for um, this. I turn that off. That is, that's on high. These are all on high. Bloom is on. You think is on. But uh, yeah. So, the gameplay doesn't look different at all, but the cutscenes look amazing when you change the graphics quality. This is the revenue chest. Yeah, this is the other way to get money, but um, I never have enough money to renovate stuff, so I'm not gonna do that. I mean, right now I only have 1,500 probably get like a new belt or something um so apparently that was the memory or is it is that the memory i don't know <sighs> That wasn't the memory. Okay, now we're about to start sequence five, memory one. Hey, Anna. Oh wait, let's, let's fill up on stuff. One thousand. That'll be all my money. All right. Well, I'll get more ammo. Um. Don't need medicine. Don't need lockpicks. I will get two of those. I have all my dessert blades. All right. So if you remember in the last episode, we killed the King of Beggars, and now we are reporting to the council.
You look terrible. For months, I have been wrangling the Brotherhood, the National Assembly, and the King. Taken all together, they have the political acumen of an especially stupid village council. I believe that excuses my appearance, young man. I meant no disrespect, Mentor. I'm only concerned. Forget me, Arnold. Weep for France. But enough politics. I hope you have happier news. What of Lord de Lassire's murderers? The King of Beggars is dead. He was carrying this. Oppose on pay. You should keep it. It'll do no one any good moldering in a forgotten crib. Carry it with honor. Thank you. I will. The mission. The King of Beggars and Sivert were only pawns in a larger game. Someone sent them after Monsieur de la Serre. Templars do nothing simply, do they? Do you have anything solid on this mysterious chess player? The only lead I have is the instrument that killed de la Serre. A pin fashioned by a silversmith named Germain. But how he's involved, I can't yet say. It seems your course is clear. Find the silversmith, learn what part he plays. Alright, so... Oh yeah, in the last episode, our reward was the officer's pistol. Let me see that. Is that better than the gun I have now? Um, pistols. Wait, did I just get this? It's Arnold's pistol. Pepper shots. Oh, this is it. Yeah, I'm, I'm not using that. Alright, to upgrade this, I need... Oh, let's do some math. 350 more upgrade points. I could hack upgrade it now, but there's really no point. Because it's easy to get the points. Um, let's see. I'm going to go through some equipment. Waste. What's the... What, oh, well, I can't get hit those. What's this? Um... Two additional smoke bombs, one cherry bomb, one ammo. Wait, why is this behind this if it costs more money? Alright, what's this one? Um, two additional smoke bombs, more lockpicks. What I really want is more medicine and more ammunition. This increases my health. More stun grenades. Um, alright, I won't get a belt. Uh, let's see, high profile noise. I don't really care about high profile, low file noise. Low file. Uh, this is the only one I can get. Minus 40% area, um, detection. I actually want to see what these look like. I'm going to take this off. Alright, um... Oh, this one looks... a little cool. What's this one? That was the one I was just looking at. This one has more health, more range armor, more melee armor. Um... What's this one? Can't get that one. This is the one I used last time for like most of the game. I really like this one. Looks nice. Um, melee and ranged armor aren't the best though. Uh, I don't even have that. I think I'm... If I can't find anything else, I'm gonna get this. Uh, hoods though. Can't afford it. Um, Eagle Vision Ring increased. Eagle Vision Duration increased. More range would be nice. I don't really care about how long it lasts. Uh, legs. Rotting noise. Mm. Um, falling damage. Less. 
falling noise less and health is more. Hmm. Yeah. I think I'm gonna go with the chest armor. If it lowers restricted area detection, that would be helpful. Yeah, I'm just gonna get it. Alright. Um let me put my outfit back on. Cause I really don't like how he looks in these clothes, but they help our skills. Um can't get any more of those stun grenades, could get that. Stealth can't get anything until next sequence. But after this mission I can get disguise, so I'll just save it for that. Let's go to the mission. I'll pause till I get to the mission. Alright, I just told us I went up from trainee to apprentice. Apprent yeah, apprentice. Well, I was an elite trainee, and now I'm an apprentice. But um, before I go to the mission, I want to show you guys what's in this gold chest. I don't know what's in it, but if it's an outfit, I'm going to show you guys where to get it. So... We just got money, and we got into a fight for opening a like, golden chest. Oh, wait a minute, then I could probably... Hold on a second. Let me kill this guy. And kill these guys. Kill all these guys. You guys should do crowd missions. Like, um, sometimes they give you money, sometimes they give you uh, weapons and tools and stuff. But now that I got money from that chest, I'm not gonna buy a weapon. I'm going to upgrade my head. No. Alright, hold on a second. Alright, I decided to get the hood. So, now we have the tailored military hood. 25% um, more evil range, 10% dur more duration and assassin cash, which I don't have yet. So we're gonna save up for upgrade points to upgrade that, and let me see what I would like without my outfit. I look nothing like an assassin. I look like a French guard with a hood. Yep. All right, um, so yeah, I just showed you where that chest was. There was no outfit in it is a bummer um but the mission is over there so i'm going to cut ahead to it this is farther away than i thought Francois Thomas Germain made the weapon that killed Monsieur de la Serre track him down and find out what his role is. not suspicious, is it? Got a lot of guards. Alright, let me see how... I forgot how many... Two sync points in this mission. Alright, well I will be able to get the disguise, which is great. The disguise is like the most helpful, um... Well... How do I put this? It's one of the most helpful skills. Stealth skills. The double assassination and the lock picks are also very helpful. And by double assassinations, I mean like ground and air. Yes, there's a skill you have to get for a ground, double ground, and double air. 
and he saw me. Can he still see me? I he can't see me anymore. Who's looking at me? Let me climb up here. I don't want anyone to see me. Don't get in conflict. Alright, where are the guards? There is a, there's a gunman over there. Gonna go after him. Are you kidding me? That is not the last place they saw me. You, you, you literally can't. Ah, oh, God. Unity. Oh, to 100% this, we need to berserk two brutes and, um, lockpick two doors. I'm a freaking lockpick level one. So, I can't upgrade it until sequence five, and this sequence. Please don't let me. It is sequence five. So, they probably have level two lockpick doors. I'm gonna berserk one of these brutes because I'm really tired of them looking at me. I can hide. I'm doing it right now. There are no berserks up here. I mean, brutes up here. Alright, uh. Let's just. Dang it. That is not possible. What the heck? I'm glad I'm not as many missions make you remain undetected because I would totally fail that. I remember in the old Assassin's Creed games when even if like they saw you and you killed them immediately before um, you got into like conflict, you would still desynchronize. Let me try distracting them with something. Not this. Here, look at that. Yeah, just look at that right there. Is, isn't that distracting? Alright, I'm tired of this guy. There, now he's dead. Are you gonna come? Oh, gosh! No, 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 stop! No, what are you... Why would you... Uh. Alright, I got away from them. Somehow, I got away from them. Why would you go all the way over there to look for me? If I just... Uh. Guards are so stupid. Alright. Now let's get in here. The little lockpick is that door. I am getting really tired of you, Brute. Can I fascinate you? There, you're dead. Yes! Lockpick level one! Lockpick level freaking one. There's a guy over there. Is he gonna turn around? No! I assassinated you, so shut up. I'm not stealthy at all. You saw me. Are you coming over here? Please don't come over here. Actually, let me berserk you. Can I berserk you? Oh, I just have to go through that door. Alright, well... To 100% this, I have to berserk two brutes. So you're both berserked. And they're gonna fight each other to the death. While I lockpick this door. Oh, I'm gonna fail. Oh, no, I didn't fail. Yay. And all the thing here is this thing. And here's another lockpick level one. Are you still fighting? Alright. The lockpick. Wow. So I pick um, two more doors after this for the 100 percent. Are they dead? All right. He's, he killed the other guy. Ah, I thought I could have something him. Here we go. He's dead now. Gonna loot these guys. 
This is a really long episode right now. Just because those first two missions weren't actually missions. So yeah. What's up, bruh? Sir Germain? Silversmith? Thank God. They've been holding me for months. Please, get me out of here. First, I need to know about this. No time. I'll tell you all I know once we're away. But we must leave. Before the guards return. Fine. Let's go. No! They'll be watching the front entrance. We'll have to go downstairs and across. Follow me, then. And stay quiet. You guys remember Germain? He was at the... Um... Elise's coronation. And he was, um... The guy who... Was in the carriage when we chased the wrong carriage. Dang it! Whoa! Where did this guy come from? I know he was behind me. What's with guns, man? Guns aren't cool. Guns... Guns are not cool. I'm gonna miss these level one Keep moving. guards as soon as we get further along in the game. I also miss that you can't Stay pick down. up people's weapons that you kill. Like I wanna use this axe and then not use it so I can use my actual weapon. It was fun. Shut up. Alright. I think I'm just gonna shoot. I haven't used my gun. There, he's dead. Missed. Missed, 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 missed. Wait, what did I do? Did I... Well, that, how'd I kill him? A quick shot? I didn't even fire. There, there's a quick shot. Yeah, I got more ammo, but I don't even remember using my gun. Definitely use Phantom Let's Blade. Go. As you say. Alright, I have more upgrade points now. I'm gonna wait until I get... Wait, what are they called? Creed points. Never mind. Hold a moment. I'm gonna wait until I get, like, um... How many Creed points? Maybe 3,000 before I upgrade my um, sword, not sword, chest and hood. Who thought it was level 1? I didn't check it. Yes. Alright. I only need to lock pick one more door to 100% this. Thank you, double assassination. Go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Now there's a ton more people. I still only need to lock pick one more door. Wait here. Is there another door to lock pick? Come on, man. Let's throw a cherry bomb. Over there. Get all of them to look over there. Kill this guy. Kill these two. And kill him. Keep moving. As you say. So surprised how smoothly that went. No, I can't win. How important are you as a prisoner? That's probably the stealthiest I will ever be during this let's play. Just so you guys know. Like I'm I'm even surprised at how, how stealthy I was. Oh, gotta reload. Headshot! Alright, and air assassinates. Let's loot this guy. Gunmen usually have ammo. But this guy didn't. Wait, what? What's going on? Hurry! Germain! Change of plans. Oh my gosh. Oh, we did have ammo. Because where else would I get that ammo from? Oh. 
Alright, so what's going on? No need to do anything foolish. Let the silversmith go. Stay back. Won't be good. What have I done? Only what you had to. Come, we must go. Yes, of course. We have been. We have been. We have been. We have been. Yeah. So he's never killed a man, uh, apparently. So but he does make weapons to kill people, and he doesn't care about that. Let's see, who's looking at me? Is one of those gunmen up there? Probably. Thank you, my friend. You've done me a great service today. Perhaps you can return the favor. Yes, of course. May I? I made the first some years ago. A private contract. A man called Lafreniere. That seemed an unusual commission. I confess, curiosity got the better of me. Recently, I started to look into Lafreniere's background, and what I discovered, I wouldn't believe it. He's a Templar. Is that what you found? Yes. I believe so. I didn't know how to take it. In any case, I was careless, and Lafreniere found out about my schemes. And a house arrest ever since. I do as he bids. Weapons mostly. Where can I find him? Well, Fenier is a very difficult man to pin down. Not long ago, I overheard him talking about protecting the shipments at La Halle Sounded ominous for every man. When I ask, why are you so interested in him? killed someone very dear to me. I want to know why. I see. You have my sympathies. I will come looking for you again. Make yourself scarce. Yes, I believe I might. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed sequence 5, memory 1. And... Let me just... Why, why can't I... There we go. Um, not a progress tracker. Skills. We now have the disguise skill. The one of the most useful skills ever. What is this? Oh, that. Yeah, that's useful too. This is useful. And these, of course, are useful. This, not really, because why share equal vision when. You can just tell them to use their Eagle Vision. I mean, I got it, but I didn't really need it. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. This is... I forgot. I think it's part 11. Um, like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. First time I said it in this entire series. But you probably should do it. So yeah, like and subscribe. <laughs>